by previously on the Screeviously. We're just giving everyone time to get their seats and get comfortable. Everybody get a snack, get a get drink. Snack. It's probably Friday. Turn your phone on, do not disturb. Do not talk to me right now. I'm watching my favorite <laughs> show. Oh, you've never heard of it? Well, here's what happens. Get Whitney the... Port watches reality TV with her husband and it's like, we're all watching together and it's a great community. It's super fun and it's like, at first I didn't like to the cave and now I'm obsessed with it. And it's like, we you. We also give facials. So today, I'm gonna do a little peel on Timmy because someone told me that exfoliation is really good for both like redness and sensitive skin. So this we're only gonna do once a week though. It has glycolic, hyaluronic, and salicylic plus stem salt complex, okay? So you just use one of these pads, the VH Method Peel, once a week. Do the back of your hands, do your neck. Don't forget all those, your elbows, like all those crepey spots that age, you know? I ain't got no crepey elbows. Tell me if it stings, okay? Yeah. Ah! Smells good. So now we do this once a week and it's, this is, you just let it on and it gently exfoliates your skin. We'll do it every week when we film reaction videos. Once a week. <laughs> That's how we'll I already know. did mine this morning. In Siesta Key, it's no surprise when relationship trouble arises. I don't want to deal with this. I'm not dealing with this. You guys have fun, and I'm done with you. All right, dog. No. Whatever, BJ. Record. It's not even worth my time. All right, that's fine. But when a friend stabs you in the back, that always hurts. That's how I felt when Kelsey was super jealous of me for getting this amazing opportunity to create my own swimwear line. All the type of fashion that you could get into is exactly what I told you that I wanted to do. I did not know that. I've told you multiple times. But she's still my best friend, and eventually, Kelsey and I decided we should just put the whole thing behind us. We oh, miss you. Amanda and JJ, on the other hand, were having trouble leaving their issues in the past. What was it about me? So don't say that. And they weren't the only relationship in trouble. Madison was getting worried about moving away from her friends and family. I don't think LA is the best place to raise children. So she convinced Ish to look at houses in the key. I don't like it. It needs work. I'm in my grandma's house. But it seemed like he was shutting down every option because he was set on LA. You are just being negative to be negative. I'm not feeling it. But while other relationships were falling apart, Sam and I were doing great. The truth is, I feel like I'm falling for Sam. She's obviously gorgeous and ambitious and nutritious. But bringing new people into the group is always bound to cause some problems. Oh, shit, what the What are you gonna say? And while I really want this relationship with Sam to work, you ain't I'm starting to wonder if being with him will destroy our group for good. Oh no, the health of the group is at risk. <laughs> She's like. <gasps> It's like I was in chalk, I was tired. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I wanna do the J the I wanna move with you uh all on I'm gonna jump in the ceiling, cut to it. Wanna jump on the ceiling, cut to the ceiling. I woke up this morning. Lizzo, probably did. I might make a friend. It's pretty nice. I know, it is nice out here. Oh, hello, my skin. Good morning. Uh huh. Oh, I needed that. Hey, dude. Whoa. I'm like. I'm glad you and I are good. You got your eyes. Me too. You and I both bottle things up, and that's not prettier the way though. That I do. Yes. Like shocking at first, because you're like, "Whoa, not used to that." But then when you really look at her, you're like, Great. so much prettier. Focus on myself and with the swimmer line, like whether you're doing it or not. Like I think that's something that I'm gonna continue to try to pursue and good. Focus make your happen. energy on that. Yeah. yeah, I know. Like that's something I wanted to do, and I don't think I focused on it fully because I was so invested in my relationship with Garrett. Covered tie yourself for two minutes. Young rich and don't pray. Homie, don't get it twisted. Keep it soft in the hand. Some of Ah. Thanks for getting me in, man. Yeah. So we're really Annie's wet dream. Check this out after we get it on there. If you want to move, we can move it. It's not permanent right now. All right, that's sick, bro. So that's the that's the longitude and latitude right there. Yeah. So yes, the key is that way. Yeah. D D E F G. You are. What are you doing? I'll fix it here. 
this show. Yeah. Josh Forge, bro. Big congrats on that, man. You did your thing. I appreciate it, bro. But some shit went down part of me and Kelsey, so it just wasn't the ideal situation. If you're in my shoes. Bad and cheap. So I've been in way more uncomfortable shoes than you've ever been in. It just kind of came down to it, bro. It just seems that we can't find that trust that we need to keep moving forward. And that's like the number one thing that you got to have. At the end of the day, like he did lie to me for two months straight and clearly can't get past our history. And I don't know. I just want to talk to him like one more time and get that final closure. And I, know, I feel I like do it's done. I feel like it's done. Give it back to him. Yeah. Oh my gosh, so much stuff happened at that party last night. I can't believe sure. JJ and Jared just like freaking waltzed in there, ready to fight. Like Jared pushing Mike in the pool. I was just like, seriously? That was insane. Like Jared is mad that Mike told everyone he cheated on Ashley, but you shouldn't cheat in the first place. Yeah. Like you can't blame someone else for your problems. Like, like, it's not Mike's cheats, fault they broke up. up. I'm the fire, I rise in a crisis. Uh -huh. I know what the price is. So they already use this song. They already use this boxing gym. Listening to Charlie. Hey, that's it. Yeah. yeah. You're ready now. You're ready for the big fight, kid. What the f are you nerds doing? Jared did get me in the pool. Oh, it's all right. He's like, let's go to the corner and talk about this one on one. Yeah. Yeah, fighting's a spectator sport. Yeah. <laughs> Do it in front of everybody. Ooh, can you punch? JJ, he's acting all tough. I can't with these guys anymore. Yeah, I like trying to stay out of the whole thing. Just like, I was trying to get you out of there and like try to avoid that stuff. No. Sam is just so opposite. He's mm -hmm. I kind of like that about him. But at the same time, it bothers me that Sam doesn't like, you know, get all angry. I think Julia, you are a red flag. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, when you get in arguments, so it shows that they care. That's Why like the he? immature side of me talking. Yes. So it's gonna be a long term thing or what? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you are into her then? Oh, for sure, yeah. What even is the deal with you guys though? Like, we're dating. I kind of want to like see what he wants because I just don't even know what we are. But I really like him. I just hope you realize you have someone that is gonna treat you right. And I think you've been more prone to kind of the bad boy. I think you finally moved on. Got a Mr. Bad I'm sitting at the top now, babe. So if I'm just a bad habit, I hope it's one you're never gonna break. These two, these two. Happy you decided to come to She's like my hair goals, kind of. Her hair looks really nice. Yeah, and then when it's that color, then I can like blow dry it nice like that. Talk to me, huh? Yeah. After leaving me in Miami by myself. By yourself? I think you had enough company there. Camilla was super jealous that Amanda was all over Brandon on New Year's oh, Eve. Oh, right. I like this. This I is like dope. It. To be fair to Camilla, Amanda was being really flirty with Brandon. These drinks. Yeah. What are you talking oh, about? You and Camilla. I'm Kill telling me. you right I'm now, talking. we are talking. But Camilla's Ooh, reaction was pretty over the top. Camilla has a left oh, cuter. This is a brand fing shirt, yo. I said, don't talk to Amanda. Yeah, I was sitting outside by myself. Amanda came and took a seat by me. What do you want me to get up and leave? I said, I need to talk to you. You really didn't care. You just said, why the f did you spill the drink on me? It's not like you were like, babe, are you, you okay? You spilled like the drink on me. What are you talking okay, about? Because I felt like you That's some it. selfish. I don't care. You, can you understand what, what I'm doing? saying? I, I can hear what you're saying. But, but I feel like it's not going Yo, in your freaking head. Let me head. talk. I don't want to date you, dude. All right. Just relax for a second. No, okay? you're like. I'm not. Just like just rude. Look. I swear, yeah. right, so what are we doing now? Nothing's getting resolved. <laughs> What do you want to do? I want you to just like show me that you're ready to like make the next step and move forward. I need you to stop talking to girls, like have any girls in your head except me. I want you to like move out of your dad's house. I don't know, I just feel like more adult things. The partying scene and doing that is just like overrated. Do you want to stay with that or do you want to lose me over it? 
You might be bad, you might be trouble, might be my Romeo. You might, you might. Is it just scary? Oh, oh. They just make it, they just edit them like that to make us so we can wonder. Have like three more scenes about it. Right. They're gonna cut my like butt. Wonder where They're not gonna cut your butt. <laughs> oh, Ish is in from Nova Scotia. Are you okay? I mean, not really. I know LA is where I need to be for my career, but just the thought of moving somewhere new. I don't know. You obviously don't want to be here. But you say no to every house, so. It's not about that. I just haven't found anything that I, I, that I like. and I... We've literally found beautiful homes. I just expected it to be a little more exciting, and I expected you to be a little more excited. Ugh, these two. <laughs> <laughs> so after spending months and months apart while Ish was in Canada for work, Madison decided that she wasn't sure she wanted to move to LA after all. You will be on the road most of the year, and I'm going to be alone in LA with no friends, no family. I think we should also consider Siesta Key. So she convinced Ish to look for houses in Siesta Key instead. Oh, I like this. It's a little dated and old. But he wasn't exactly happy about it. Look, I just don't like that. I think you're influenced by the fact that this is home and this is where you grew up, and I get that. But I don't think you're thinking long term about what your I passion is and what your. Yes, I know that in LA there are more acting opportunities for me. I know that. But I don't want to be there in like a really tough cutthroat industry, and I don't want to be there by myself. Like you're literally gonna I'm be not gone. Leaving you. You're gonna be gone seven months of the year, and you know that. So what are you proposing, though? I think she wants to just buy a house in Siesta Key and not be an actress. Yeah, yeah. She, so they're having conflict because she's lying to herself. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. <laughs> If I stop traveling and I'm there with you, would you consider LA rather than Siesta Key? How are you gonna make the money? All you talk about is how much you love your adventure shows and like traveling and like that's your passion. Like I would never ask you to put that aside, ever. But I might just like torture you with guilt about it. <laughs> Forever. No matter what, whether that's in LA or Southeast Asia. I don't know, maybe I just never had a reason to stay home. But now you have a reason. Mm -hmm. and you can try to be there as much as possible. That's all I need. I can do that. Then I can move to LA. Boom. Well, then let's make that happen. Okay, great. Now you guys are off the show? Yeah. yeah you excited? <laughs> that's what Juliet would like. <laughs> She was like, ugh, these guys again. We also have another birthday party. Little announcement? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my dad. It's kind of a big bomb to drop on him. Obviously, like, before I leave, I want everything to be good. Yeah, yeah well, good luck. Soon. Yeah. Coming up. A ring is a symbol of a promise, and I think he owes you that. We are... Promise ring? ...moving to <laughs> L.A. I feel like your intentions with Sam are not completely genuine. I can't believe you said that. The first thing to understand about this business is client psychology. He was definitely reluctant to take this job. I feel like I'm selling out. I just feel like this is the conversation everybody has before they eventually end up giving up on their dreams. Isn't selling out when you're really successful? Like you're already a big star and then you do something just for like a lot of money? You know, like a Doritos ad or, you know, like yeah, selling out. Yeah, I think typically that, but I think you can, it can be less, like, extreme. You don't have to just be a, a, a big star to use the phrase, sell out. I think you do. Oh, really? Yeah. What do you guys think? He's a star. Tell us in the comments. Is Brandon selling out or not? But he's been trying to prove to his parents and Camilla that he can be responsible. The question is, can he? is he actually happy? Well, how was your new year? Started out good, and then, um, Camilla literally threw a full drink in my face. Whoa, mm. glass and all or just a drink? She must have been upset, huh? This is very unlike Camilla. She was mad, man. Have you talked to her since you've been back? <sighs> yeah, I, t I talked to her, um, and like the vibe I got was pretty much like either we move in or we break up. Yeah, wow. 
that puts me in a position where it's like, damn, you know, because it's like, I don't know if like I'm ready for that. You don't have an apartment. If I were 50 and I were with Camilla right now, I feel like everything would be great. But oh, man, I just got so much going on. I have to be selfish in certain things, you know? I mean, it's hard because I really care for Camilla a lot. And I feel like I'm in a situation where I have to really choose what I'm going to do, you know? You're just going to play everything. You know? That's a big step. There's no escaping. Yeah. You gotta come through with some more advice. Man. Yeah, because really he's about to, to make a big mistake. Have a committed relationship before you say, I'm gonna live with you. I'll take you to the future. Oh, I'll take you to the future. Hi, sweetie. Hi, baby. How are you? Good, how are you? Well, I haven't seen you in a while. Missed you at Thanksgiving. I'm sure it was uh, a horrible Thanksgiving uh, without me. Madison's dad and Ish have had a rough history. Are you ready? <laughs> the age difference between Madison and Ish has always been a problem for her dad. This guy's gonna be an old man when you're 30 years old. You do not have my approval on this. And when they first brought up the idea of moving in together, her dad did not approve. I don't think it's well thought out. I don't think it's in your best interest, and I don't know what else. Since then, Madison hasn't talked to her dad about moving to LA again. So he's been under the impression she's staying in Florida. It's just one hurdle after the other for Madison and Ish. Well, how are you, how are you guys doing? Good. Yeah? Oh, boy. Oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> drinks ahead, they need drinks ahead. <laughs> yeah, you need a drinks ahead. On a giant carafe of corn nuts. nuts. <laughs> what the frick? What the frickin' frack? That is a huge pour. That is just straight scotch <laughs> in a glass. Well, we have an announcement. Huh? Tree clubs love tramps. Yeah. Facts. <laughs> so, Ish and I have decided that we are officially moving to LA. I thought you were gonna be stay, sticking around in Florida. If she really wants to pursue acting and be passionate about it, I think LA is where you need to be. Yeah, and obviously his career is based out of LA. You're gone all the time though. You don't wanna be alone out there. Yeah. It's a big city. He has committed to looking for more jobs in LA and not traveling as much. Well, this is news. Yes. Um, Poor dad. Mm -hmm. Also, like Madison, if you don't have any friends here, like, just... we'll take you to the baked potato something. Yeah, Madison. If she's all alone. Madison. I don't want her to be all alone. Madison. Do you live here, right? You have to change the spelling of your name, though. I can't. I just can't. Yeah, no, I'm it won't. That, I won't put that number on my sure. phone. Yeah. I won't put your no, name on my phone. No, it will be M-A-D-I. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> and I'm very protective. I, I get that. I need to make sure she's safe and doing the right thing. This is, this is what you want. Yeah, what are you going to do, right? You got to say, OK. It's like I pretended I wanted to be here for the show, but we can't tell that storyline anymore, so we gotta go. Yes, you seem like a good man. Um, I appreciate that. You do. Deep down. Mm -hmm. Not even deep down. He, he seems, seems like, like a yeah, good guy. He seems like a good guy. B and I want you to be successful. Oscar. Or don't come home. Well, you know, considering everything, um, go for it. Yeah, like maybe he can even help him out with the down payment, you know? Yeah. He's a rich lawyer with a leather golf bag. Thank you. Thank you. Aw, poor dad. Have you discussed this with anybody else other than family? Nope. We haven't announced it to anyone yet. Maybe I'll tell them at my birthday party. Jung -yaw. Oh my god, how many looks back and forth can they possibly do? Coming. If he shows up tonight, he's gonna try to fight one of you two. 
Man a category seven. Step out the place level. Clean like Jesus, fresh out of heaven. Wreck the place, inevitable. Just turn up the bass and the treble. Car. You happy? You excited? See everybody? I'm kind of nervous to tell everyone. What event, what all cast events is it? It's Madison's birthday. Uh, and an event space? Mm hmm. It's a reggae themed party? What <laughs> the is going on? Good to see okay, you. Okay, you guys clean up What's nice. up? Yeah, we'll Cheers. Cheers to the good life. The Madison. Great, right, it's her birthday. So, Mike, are you scared yeah. JJ's gonna yeah. show up? You think you're gonna get pushed in the pool again? No, of course. So remember Joe? Dost thou love me? I know that wilt say I, and I will take thy word. He was the cute guy from Madison's acting class who got Ish all jealous. I actually know a lot about Ibsen. So oh, yeah? If you would like help with it. OK. There's this one kid, Joe, who's really nice and offered to like run lines with me. Well, maybe Chloe can run lines with you. Joe's been helping Madison work on her monologues and scene work, so they've gotten really close. Seems like I might end up in LA. Yeah. It'd be nice. Maybe we could go out there together. You know, I just, there's also, I mean, I have a boyfriend out there. Yeah, um, he's a producer out there. He's a really good guy. He's uh -huh. older, but. How much older? He's got a good 20 years on me. Oh, I want you to be my boyfriend. Ish. Great. This guy did not. Hey, Joe. Nice to meet you. Nice Finally. Nice I've heard some yeah. stuff about you. So you're the lucky guy. Yes, I am. <laughs> Very. Extremely. Yeah. Yes, you are. Oh, God. Whoa, Joe. You're in yeah. the We have a great time in acting class together. We really do. Just, you know, she's really talented. So. He's been so incredibly helpful. Yeah. Well, He's she is very talented. Yes. I know that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah. 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 Uh, I gotta be honest, the only thing I knew about you was that uh, you, you were a producer and that you were older than her. So slightly, slightly, yeah. slightly. Yeah. Uh, Joe, you need to leave. Yeah. Joe, Joe, Joe you need to leave. Uh, yeah, I think I'll go get some water real quick. Thank you, yeah. Joe. Thank you. Yeah. Thank, you. Yeah. thank you, Joe. Thank you. I'll see you. No, of course. So, thank you. Also, yeah. This is really yeah. nice, yeah. but yeah. also getting drunk. Well, he's obviously got a thing for you. Yeah, I can't, don't be negative. Baby, you deserve it. You deserve it. Treat yourself. Yeah, treat yourself. This plastic cups did Wait, not make Can you explain money. to me what is this? Obviously from Sam. Her boyfriend chain. How much is Her this? 30K. Dude, that thing weighs as much as you do. Oh my god, Juliet. So guys, there you go. Just like, well, it's definitely his and she's just wearing it. I don't think he got it for her. I really no, hope he didn't get it. No, I don't her. think that is not. He would not. No, that is a guy's chain. Just like, Sam, why is Juliet wearing your necklace? She just took it, I guess. She I don't took know. it. Baby, you gifted this yeah, to me. Yeah. All right. Anyways, she's here. just jealous. Oh, they'll come for sure. I don't know. Maybe she's up tonight. He's gonna try to fight one of you two. I know, I know. Are you two gonna be civil or are you gonna come at him? I'll be civil. I've got no problem with them. Like, I think uh, he's the one that's gonna have the issue. I don't know. We'll see. I mean, I'll call him out. I have no problem calling him out. Oh, I don't really wanna be that guy. Another Jung Yath, Jung Youth song. Coming up, Ish and I are moving in together. Oh. Wow. You sure? Telling no, such an actor. Like, I just wanted yeah. to dump you before um, we even started dating. Yeah. So like, great, thanks for having me here, you fucker. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. yeah. Dancing too hard. I gotta go dancing. Oh, oh sh Alex here. Oh, Anyways, they showed up alone again. Those guys. I don't want to make it obvious, but like, it does suck seeing him with his little play toy. It's just annoying because I can't even talk to him on a civil level when he's got that hurt. What about you guys? You guys dating Vibin. now? Vibing? You know how it is, though. It's like both of you care, but like you have to pretend like you don't. You gonna go down? Thank you so much for stopping by. I know you're busy. Yeah. 
Uh, I was <laughs> He's, no, I'm not. All right. No. I was gonna make an announcement to everybody. Oh. Um, so I'll just tell you. Um, I am leaving. I'm moving to LA. Oh. Ish and I are moving in together. Uh, wow. You're, you're sure? Yeah, believe me. I spent a fair amount of time trying to convince Ish to pick up and move here, but. Yeah, no. But convincing someone else is hard. Especially someone who's older than you and has different priorities. Well, I mean, I think his priorities are me. Yeah. I'm not moving for him. Yeah. I'm moving for us as a relationship, but also because I do want to pursue acting. Yeah. You should pursue it. You want, you know, right? Oh, is it? Convincing. I really do appreciate the concern, but this is what I want. This is this is my dream. Is it good? Well, as a complete stranger, I'll just go ahead and continue to mind my own business, okay? It's with my dream guy, so. This is your dream guy? No. I have to go. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> I need to get the f out of here, okay? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Thank you for everything. You're welcome. I am for this. <laughs> It's two right. times hanging out. Yeah, I run. See ya. Maybe they got closer. Babe, don't ruin my cynicism. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? I don't know. I just think it's going to be hard to say goodbye. They do have a whole world here. And... But it's going to be hard. Yeah, but you've always known that. Don't be upset. Also really good. It's a new chapter for you. And I think everybody's going to be super supportive. He's it's producing not easy her. saying goodbye. Mm -hmm. But I think it's a good thing. I think, so. I think it's a really good thing. Mm, produced. Look what you're leaving behind, all these people that hit each other. Who's that woman in the middle? <laughs> uh, Hi. Hi. How you doing? Hi, Dan. Yeah, I know we're gonna keep seeing each other. And that's like what makes it even more difficult, is like knowing that. I talked to Curly, like, she did tell me, didn't she? I can 100% tell you, Kelsey, I did not hunk up with your boyfriend. I didn't cheat, but still, it's it's still not right for like me. He's like, I still want to be broken up with you. I don't want to end up like all of them. Yeah, fair enough. In their exes. I don't do it. Brandon's always making this weird face. Been in each other's lives and like hating each other and talking shit on one another behind each other's backs. Like, I don't want that to be us. Kelsey, I would never do that to you. You should know that. And I always want to be like a part of like your life, but whether even if. But you can't be. No, no, I can't. You cheated on me too much. I understand. I really thought like this time would be different. Contained within the jar are 369 days of things I love about you. Maybe us being on the break right now is what's best for both of us. I don't want to lose you again. I know. I love you. I love you. <laughs> A key to my apartment. <laughs> Oh, take it back. I used a heart keychain. <laughs> Good breakup. Good breakup. Good breakup. Mm -hmm. She's hammered. Oh Rolling. <laughs> This is not just a birthday party. 
this is a goodbye party. Lay what the Can I check this out? I'm just gonna come right out and say it. Where is this going? Uh... <sighs> this is not just a birthday party, this is a goodbye party. I have a lot of aspirations in LA. You wanna look at everybody? Yeah, sure do. Okay. That, girl, that girl's on Big Brother. <laughs> she was. Which one? The one with that extremely tall man. Oh my god, shoulder. you're right. Yeah. She was. Yeah. Um, and that's it. So Ish and I have decided to leave Siesta Key. We are moving to LA. They should move to week. Nova Scotia. Oh. Yeah. Mm, bummer. Leave all of you behind and I love you all. Love you. Love you. Love you. Where was Paige? Not invited. Mm, good call. Such a bright party. I can't believe Madison's moving to California. I know. I'm honestly not surprised though. I knew she was going to eventually. Hi beauties. Hello. What are you doing? We were just talking about Madison's speech. Here's oh, mine. that was so sweet. I mean, but like, honestly, think about it for a second. Like, is it really the best decision for her to move to LA for Ish, who's pretty much 50 years old? I think this is really what she wants. I really do. It's a good turnout. It's good. You happy you told everybody? Yeah. Oh, she's having a full mountain break. She's not focused on how she's going to feel in the future when her husband or whatever he's going to be. Like in, in ten years, years he's going to be, be six, pretty much. Yeah, sexy. he's going to be sixty or seventy. I just hope she knows what she's getting. I thought she said in ten years he's going to be sixty or seventy. <laughs> it's like no, no, we'll just be one of those. Get yourself into it, you know. Is this Ariana Grande? Yeah, this is this is not this is playing. That would look really nice on like a wall, right? Isn't it, it on the wall right now? <laughs> yeah, right. thank you. Oh. If it was on a wall at our place. Oh. What? At our place? At our place, baby. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, that's what's up. Nope. Uh -uh. nope. I mean, I've been thinking about it, and honestly, like, it's always been you. You know, like. You got the slot. It's not anybody else that I'm looking at, it's you. I don't want to wait anymore. I'd rather just like start looking at places, you know? Oh my God. Yay, I'm so happy. Very nice. Tomorrow? Tomorrow. <laughs> Much in just a short amount of time, they've been back together. And even though Camilla may be a little jealous, maybe that's what Brandon needs. It's nice to see the group maturing. I love you. I love you. You guys are not maturing, okay? I just want you to know that. This feels finale. Mm -hmm. uh, little Wayne. Is like, she Madison moving? No. Uh, no, I can't believe she's moving to Los Angeles. I know. I, I love Ish, but like that's a big move for her. You know what I mean? She's ready to go, and she loves him. I don't really blame her. Like. How about everything I do creeps everyone else out? Mm. I'm just gonna come right out and say it. Where is this going? Like, I really like you. Yeah, I mean, I like you too a lot, obviously, you know. Uh, obviously, you know. So. I guess, uh, so. So what? I don't know, like, like dude, would you like want to make it official? Give me love, give me light, keep it light, yeah. Watching us, can't catch up in the daylight, yes, I do. I ain't here to waste, waste, y'all. I really don't like starting shit between friends, but Kelsey was like, what do you think Julia's intentions are with you, Sam? I'm gonna check this if that's okay with you. I don't wanna like offend anybody, but I'm gonna check this right now. Oh, you're gonna check it? I'll check it with you. Mike's calling me. 
Hello? Yes, I'm Clay. Nothing. Julia and I are having a class with Rose. Where are you guys at? The Overton. All right, uh, you guys gonna be there for a minute? Yeah. I got some like pretty interesting stuff to tell you. I think you guys are both like to hear so. Ooh, I love gossip. Over there, right? Oh Wait. yeah, come meet us. Yeah, uh, hurry up. You guys a bit. Okay, bye. Okay, see ya. Wait, what do you think he's about to tell us right now? Um, that I'm a gold digger? Yeah. It's not about either of us, honestly. Madison's party was so much fun. Yeah, it was like, fun. That location that she found was really cute. Yeah, I really like it. I don't know. I just feel like she's moving way, way, way too fast. I'm a little worried that Madison may be doing it for the wrong reason. Madison Baby, wants that white fun. picket fence and with her 50-year-old boyfriend. Hey, if it means marriage and a kid, she's all in. Nice, hey. ladies. Yeah. That guy works for the show. That guy? Yeah. Location, Scott. Good. Tell us your gossip. Honestly, it's hard for me to say because I really don't like starting shit between friends. Bro, really? Mm, seems like you do. Yeah. Seems like you do. Seems like you do. Uh, I think Kelsey's really salty right now. <laughs> This morning, Kelsey was like, hey, do any of you want to get brunch? We ended up going with her. We went to Who's the Ritz. We? Sam and I. Why? Everything was cool. We sit down. And then out of nowhere, she goes, what do you think Julia's intentions are with you, Sam? What the hell? And she goes, well, I'm just kind of worried about you, Sam. I think she might be in it for the wrong reasons. She and said like, this in front of you and Sam. Yes. Yeah, well, she took us out to brunch. Yeah. Really strong feelings for Alex. Yeah, exactly. You. That's and exactly what a friend should not do. Me as a guy, I'm not going to go all in because I'm she's just going to look dumb and she's going to go back. Yes. Honestly, I can tell she's been jealous of me for like a long time now. For sure. Did Sam believe her? Oh, not at all. No, no, no. We actually Did walked away and laughed. Her relationships have always been like There's this. Nothing. And look at what Sam is. Sam is one of the nicest people I've ever met. So what is she going to do? Try and ruin that relationship. What have I said about Kelsey? For years, that girl only cares about herself, and she will f over anyone, literally, anytime. No, I don't know what I'm saying. Right What's Kelsey thinking, man? She's hmm. about to get the, all the main person <coughs> turned against her. She just wants to stir shit up and... Did they not film that brunch? They didn't. Interesting. Which makes it feel more like... Real. Yeah. Hey! hey. Your favorite! <gasps> oh my god! Pizza and salad! And my favorite too. Are you eating all right now that Alex is in externship? It's been hard. Like, we don't really see each other as much, but it'll be worth it once he graduates and becomes a lawyer. All right, well, let me talk about the big elephant in the room. Your chain? She's torturing me. She doesn't have a ring on her finger. What's going on? She just wants kind of like a little bit of security for you. So you kind of get what I'm talking about? Money. Yeah, I do. I mean, every girl dreams about the love of their life, getting on one knee and proposing, but like, how am I even supposed to bring that up, you know? That pineapple. You know, you've been mm -hmm. put through a little bit more than I would really like. And some of the things weren't so great. So maybe your mother's got a point. A ring is a symbol of a promise. And I think maybe he owes you that. I mean, I want that too. I see myself with him forever, but. Push that hair back. I don't think a ring's just gonna make someone like. Yeah. Be a good boy. My, my. I thought Kelsey and I had made up after our swimwear line fight, but now she's saying these horrible things about me to Sam. I feel so sick that my best friend would betray me like that. I texted her telling how hurt I am, and now I'm just waiting for her to get home to confront her. Who can be the first one to cry? Oh she my showed God. up crying. Yeah. She's been, no. she's been going down. She's like, you're crying? Like, she can't even look at her. I mean, like, why? Like, what even happened? What were you thinking? What was and it? Why? Yeah. yeah. Why would? Why were you telling Sam, like, do you want to hear her intentions are off? Her heart might not be in a good place. It's like, why would you say that? Okay, when I hear what I actually have to say. Oh, Kelsey, you are you know, yeah, you know, So I've told Sam, I just want to make sure 
no matter what, that you full on are into him because at the end of the day, you still are in love with Alex. Who told you that? What? Okay. Don't you think it's weird for you to tell him that I'm in you love with what? my ex? I would never go up to a guy and tell them, listen, like, that's watch your not, back. That's not with the her. way I said it. Well, when you go in and say she's still in love with her ex-boyfriend, like, how okay, do you think well, that makes it feel? it's your problem that you walk all over guys, and I don't want you walking all over Sam. Wow. You're literally, like, acting like you're closer to him than you are to me. And I really think this goes all back to the fact that you're mad at me about the bathing suit line. Juliet. If you genuinely felt She's like, like I was mistreating start. him, Sorry, you would have spoken to me okay. and not when spoke to I'm him alone you, without okay. me. I'm speaking to you right now. I think you were trying to get back at Alex. I feel like your intentions with Sam are not completely genuine. So you can tell that they're not. Look at her face. <laughs> Look at her face. Kelsey, I actually have only ever liked guys that are assholes, and I'm finally maturing up. And I also am actually, like, happy. He is literally so sweet, and he's so kind. And I really like him. No, you don't. You're but genuinely also, into him for who he is and not no, his money? No. Yeah. No. Actually. Wow, really? I mean, it's crazy for her to say that to her face. She's right, yeah. but that's not something a friend says. Yeah. <laughs> no, a friend would would say that to a friend, but maybe not on ca on camera. I mean, Juliet, I think, has a right to be offended by someone saying that, yes. even though it also happens to be true. Yeah. I've known Sam for like five years. Yeah, but you had Alex then. You had Alex's money. You had Alex's status. Like, wow. You had all that. You're thing. really doing that. I can't I really you're doing that. Okay. You like bad guys. I'm trying to change that. I for know what? you are. Well, then, like, don't but get you involved. Don't like Sam that much. You don't know that. Okay. I actually do really like him a lot more than you think that I do. Sarah. Then I have nothing left to say to you. Oh, is this friendship ending? Mm -hmm. I don't know if they can recover from this. No, they can't live Just together. when I was recovering from my first big heartbreak, recovering. Kelsey broke my heart again. Oh, no. I may know. That wasn't really cool of Kelsey to do that on the show. Oh. My. Am I the seeing pictures correctly? Pictures of her. Yeah. And, and them and hearts. On his car. And the eight times is in Oh, it's Valentine's Day. It's crazy how so much can change in a year. Happy Valentine's Day. This is so cute. There you go. I didn't wrap it very well, but. Oh you don't have a God. watch. So, yeah. Whether we're starting new relationships. Sam, this is insane. So you, don't, you don't have a watch. That watch is crazy. This goes, you mean a lot to me. Handling old ones. I'll make you so sure about it. This is finale. We're making uh -huh. a clean break. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. You're lost, baby girl. Life I care it might be literally uh, uh oh. Hey. I guess it's all just part of growing up and starting the next chapter. See ya. Remember us? That things will never be the same. <gasps> Babe, come here. I'm trying to figure out which one looks the best. Mm, none of them. None of them. Reaches. Mm -mm. You're like mauve, taupe, or... Barf? Or barf. Life has a funny way of keeping us on our toes. <gasps> Whoa. taught me a lot about myself. Because of some physical violence. And while I feel like I've accomplished so much, it's really your show. Mm -hmm. I know that this is only the beginning. Somewhere. Full body chills. Mm. I'm such a little dweeb. <laughs> <laughs> Alana Wagner, Avi, Asha, Joe, Rivera, John Ernst, Kendra, Pascar, Jeffrey, Klein, Adam Belfair, Sunset, Arrow, Taylor, Dice, Ruiz, Navas, Valerie Hunt, Catherine Rios, Yana Yang, Brian Carrillo, Samantha Kraft, 
lot of plants, spare Galano, I gotta play quiet, I'm gonna blow you, blow you. Create creature, TM skills, film, entertainment, one email, you know, by Palm International Incorporated, get that thing out of my face. <laughs> what are you doing? Next on, say it, next on. The next on. Previously on the screen. That could have been the finale. Oh, we don't get a next on, because it was, was probably finale. the finale. God only knows what I'd do without you. God only knows. That's a full God Nelson. That. God only knows. God only knows what. God only knows. God only knows. Get, get, get. Um, we have the reunion, so we're going to do a reunion next. Maybe. No, we have it. Oh, I, I know, but I think there's like another. There's Annie another thinks there's another episode. episode. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. see Bye.